title goes to the team with the best record, and uh, you know our kids earned that. And certainly last night was, uh, you know, we were all watching it and hoping for you know who, and um, and you know our, our dreams and things were kind of realized in somewhat last night when when Princeton was able to win that game. It was all while we were studying, and then once it got close to the end, the studying kind of stopped, and um, my roommate Andrew and I, because he's my roommate, obviously, and we were just we just started watching it. And once the game was over, we went outside and we were just running in the freezing cold, screaming at the top of our lungs. It was just awesome. One of the things that we're going to try to utilize with our kids, you know, that we've been in a tournament and we won a tournament already, um, and because we don't have a postseason conference tournament, I think that could be very important for our psyche that we've played in something in a you know, neutral, quote unquote, side. And, Perform fairly well against some high-level teams, uh, so I'm hopeful that you know we can revisit those thoughts and feelings and that and that result um, that can help us as we kind of go into this tournament, not knowing where we're going to be or who we're going to play until until Sunday. It's kind of been a slow, but uh, but really fun and tough uh, a build-up to now. And uh, like I said, you know, it's 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 awesome to get to this point and you know. Really get over the hump and get in the tournament, but you know we're back at, at square one because now now we're in the tournament. We've achieved this, and uh, it's, it's not just about that. It's about you know you know showing that we deserve it, and you know we're a top 25 caliber team once we get in and, and play our first round game.